Hello, everyone. Welcome to Blue Bud Adventure. This is our third day in Alaska. We saw a moose on the way to the airport. We're all on board a Cessna, and the pilot is、um, from Alaskan Airlines. Basically, due to the pandemic, Alaskan Airlines have、uh, put a lot of pilots on leave. So he lives in Alaska now and、uh, flies the touristy airplanes. And we are very lucky to have him with us. We are on our way to Lake Park National Park. It's the second least visited national park in the whole world, and you can only access the national park by plane or by boat. By boat, it'll take a long time. So we're doing this by plane. It's about 45 minutes flight from Hamar, and、um, the weather is horrible. Rainy and the flight is quite bumpy. Here we are. Take a photo in front of the plane. We see bear paw prints on the beach everywhere. So the width of the bear paw in inches is actually the height of the bear in height. So basically, if the bear paw is five inches wide, the bear itself would be five feet tall. And the bears are actually coming down to the beaches. Digging up、uh, the clams, the shell shellfish, for dinner, or lunch, or breakfast. They actually spend、uh, 16 hours per day eating in this type of season because it's been a long winter, and they only have three months to feed themselves,、uh, beef themselves up for the winter. The age of the bear can be observed by watching his or her back. Like this one, his back is arching inside. That means、uh, he's a little bit older. If the back is flat, that means it's a cub or a much younger bear. There are about two、uh, thousand to three thousand bears in Lake Clark National Park, and、uh, they've been living there for thousands of years. They are called brown bears. If you look at their furs, they're brownish in color, but they're in the grizzly family. I believe、uh, feeding on seafood、uh, makes their fur look brown, while the bears in Denali look a little bit gr bit gray. Looks really like grizzly because、uh, they feed on different species such as mooses, caribous,、uh, and more meat versus seafood. Aside from seafood, the brown bears are also feeding on sedges、uh, in the grassland. Sedges are a great plant. They're very juicy and they contain over 30 percent of protein. So basically, they have、uh, vegetables and they have seafood together. Smart bears. And usually, end of June is their mating season. So they all come down from the mountains、uh, when the snow melts, and they search for food, and then they find their partners. Usually, a female can have a few partners、uh, to get ready to be pregnant. However, many cubs she has is determined upon how many pounds of weight she gains throughout、um, the summer. So, if she gained three and four hundred pounds, she may have up to five bear cubs, which is quite a lot. And、uh, the bear cubs usually stays with their mom for three to five years. They'll nipping on mom's milk for up to five years.、Uh, well. Learning how to live independently on their own. Brown bears are very smart animal. In certain seasons,、uh, people saw two brown bear brothers, adult male bears,、uh, playing with the, each other. Like when they were kids, they can recognize each other pretty easily. Before we came to the bear adventure, the people who work at the Alaskan Bear Adventure Company told us if we came to Lake Clark National Forest and saw no bears, there'll be a full refund of the flight fees. That was interesting. Now we're coming back, landing in Hamar safely. This is Hamar, Alaska, where the land ends and the sea begins. This is the west furthest area. Or west for this point, you can drive to in the United States. Pretty amazing.
you need to take a photo at the end of the road, just like you will need to take a photo uh, in Florida, 90 miles to Cuba. This is the uh, AK fish fryers. It is the uh, number one best uh, fish and fries in town. So Arnold researched online and we have to try it. So we ordered a five piece halibut to test it first. If it's good, we're going to order more. Hopefully it's good. Let's cross our fingers. <laughs> AK fries, halibut five piece. Is it good? No one tasting it. Is a fry good, Hatha? Yeah. Okay. This is Russian town. It's actually 20 miles east of Hummer. Really, really quiet. Hard to get to place, but breathtakingly beautiful. 